hello guys welcome back to the my youtube channel today i am going to solve this hacker rank problem based on the interview preparation kit problem is basically belongs to the array and the problem name is as given array left rotation a left rotation operation on an array shift a each of the array element one unit to the left for example if two left rotation are performed on the given array at 1 2 3 4 5 then the array would become 3 4 5 1 and 2 note the that the lowest index item move to the highest index in a rotation this is called circular array Given an array A of n integer and the number of D perform the perform D left rotation on the given array. Return the updated array to be printed as a single line of separate space separated integer. Function description complete the function rotate left in this editor below. Rotate left has the following parameter integer type of array and A which is the length n and the array to rotate and the d the number of the rotation is required to perform on the given array finally return type we have to return the array after performing the all those operations input format the first line contains two space separated integer n and d the size of and d the size of the array is a a and the number of the left rotation needs to be performed. The second line contains n separated value integer each an array of i. For the constraint, the size of the array will be more than 1 and less than equal to the 10 to the power 5 and the number of the rotation will be greater than 1 and less than equal to the n that is the size of the array and the value of this array item will be more than 1 and less than equal to the 10 to the power 6 for the simple input test here the first first input is given 5 it means the length of the array is 5 given and we have to rotate this item for four times in the left order okay finally the output will be 5 1 2 3 4 5 well, we can understand using this explanation when we perform the operation D for four time left rotation, the array undergoes the following sequence of change. Initially, our array item will be 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and the, after first rotation, the value will become 2, 3, 4, 5, and the 1 because we are performing the left rotation. It means we are shifting our first position item to the right and the similarly we are again shifting our first item that is the two to the right side so the value will become three four five one and two and on the third rotation the value will become four five one two and three and the finally last rotation the value will become five one two three and four this is all about the explanation and the test cases so guys let's move to the code editor so we'll write some code to satisfy this problem statement i need an array that uh, will return after the performing the operation so i'm going to create one array um, giving name as a new array and the uh, and the size of the array will be the remain the same as the given array i need another variable which needs to store the index of the new array and initially i am going to make it minus one i need one for loop using that i will be looping through the element and the inside this uh, in the uh, i value will become the d and uh, it will it will check i less than equal to a dot length and i plus plus uh, new array now i'm going to update the this value and it will start from the start index and array of 
i current index value this is start index value is the minus 1 so i am using plus plus pre increment operator it will update the first update the index value and set the value i need the similar for loop so i am copying here and i'll paste it here and modify ac accordingly and now i am changing this uh, i variable to zero and this condition will be go till the d and the and the remain uh, things will remain same and the finally we have to return this new array let's understand this logic using this uh, example as let's assume i have this array and it has this value 1 2 3 4 and 5 and the d is equal to given 3 the first loop will do it will take the item from the index uh, given value d and it will copy the all the item into the new array uh, so the index is given 3 so it will take the item of index 3 that is the value 4 and the and the it will go uh, add till the length of the array so this will be the last element of the given array and the second loop will do it will take the item from the index 0 and it will goes till the d so it will copy the 1 2 and 3 and the finally item of the given array uh, will be 4 5 1 2 and 3 that's it about the coding let's uh, run this sample test Yeah, it passed the all simple test case. Let's again submit this code for final evaluation. Yeah, it passing the all test case without any time complexity. So, guys, if you think this video is helpful for you, please please hit the like button and subscribe my channel if you not subscribed yet. And don't forget to share with your friends so that they can also make use of it. And Finally thank you thank you for watching